How much protein should you be eating every day? Do you know? Well, if you look it up on the internet, you'll be filled with a million and one different answers. So it can be very confusing. So hopefully I'll give you some sort of explanation which will make a bit more sense. Protein levels very much depend on your goals and your activity levels. If you're an elite athlete, then you're going to require a lot more protein because protein is the essential building blocks to repair and grow all the tissues in our body. But if you're looking for longevity, then maybe you need to decrease your protein and I'll explain why in a minute. So the age old adage when it comes to getting that beach body, leaning out, increasing muscle mass has been to eat one gram of protein per pound of body weight. So if you weighed 130 pounds, that would be 130 grams. If you wanted to weigh 130 pounds, you need to eat accordingly, so 130 pounds. If you're a 200 pound male, you need to be, and you wanna be 180, you need to be eating 180 grams of protein. That is one end of the scale. That is for pure, get that body. Now, longevity, and what I love, the word at the moment I love is health span. So what can you do to increase your longevity in as life uh, and your health span. Um, so the people in the areas of the world that live the longest typically have between 10 to 15 percent of their calories coming from protein only, and that's not much. So that would be typically for the average woman about 35 to 55 grams of protein a day, and for the average man that would be about 70 grams to 80 grams of protein. You can see there's a big difference here between longevity and between aesthetics and getting the body. Now, I like to sit in the middle. I think you should be in the middle. And I'll tell you a reason, because most people, typically 30s to 50 year olds, looking to maintain or build a little bit of lean muscle going into later life, which is great for longevity to maintain that muscle mass. Um, typically training one to two times a week, so fairly active, but want to maintain that long lifespan as well. So I, I would recommend going with 20% of your calories coming from protein. So what does that look like? So for a person eating 1500 grams, uh, 1500 calories a day, that's going to look, that's going to be 75 grams of protein. For someone eating 2000 calories a day, that's going to be about 100 grams of protein. So that is where I sit, right in the middle. I think you should lean into that longevity, of course, but increase it slightly so that you maintain your muscle mass and therefore um, that will also benefit you long-term down the road too. Cheers.